Hello, this is Den Wills from denwills.com and I'm just going to show you how you how easy it is to use Canva for um, any one of your social media platforms. Um, I am going to, this is your main page when you go, this is the free version, obviously you can upgrade but I, I get everything I need from the free version so I, I personally don't need to upgrade. Um, so basic templates, so I'm going to go and so if you get your templates here or you can or you can press as you can see down here as well on social media um, then you've got your Instagram Facebook now I'm gonna go Facebook post I'm actually making up some bonus pages I'm actually doing a review um, on a software so I'm just I'm using this I'm just using it as Facebook post here so you start off with a plain square now obviously you need a little background So you can see all these are free, so you can use any one of these you like. So if you're if you're doing a product that you know emotionally, if it's calming, you might want to go for something like blue and sea like, or the skies. I like this is quite a nice one, quite a soothing one. It's quite lovely. Have that as your little background. Um, a lot of these are free. Some of them, obviously, you have to go to the other version. But there's a lot here that you can use that are free. Okay, so that's how you use your background. And then basically, we're going to add some text. So I'm going to click on add a heading here. And then I am just because I'm going to write here. And I just highlight it and then put in what I want. Bonus to talk. Oh, obviously, you put in your own whatever you want for yours. I want to change that to white. I think white would look nice. Oh, no. As you can see, you can't see it. Grey. Grey is really lovely actually. Quite like grey. I think that's really nice. So maybe a bit darker. Perfect. Then obviously if you want it, click on the size. Let's do it a little bit bigger. 60 is going 72. A bit bigger than that I think. See, there you go. Now I want to put this at the top. Lovely. Perfect. Now, obviously, I, I'm going to do the little logo, um, the information product that I am going to be doing a review on. It's called the Commission Machine. So I, I need this. So basically, I'm going to click on this logo. Save image as. Save it in my picture. So I'm just going to put it. A new folder. Okay, I'm saving them all in separate folders. I'm going to save that one there. Okay, so let's get back to. Also, at the top here, we've got here bonus tutorial. Um, I'm going to put in here uh, the title of this, which is I've just done it. What is is Facebook? Permission. This tutorial. Okay. Uh, right. So I want to upload this logo. So basically, click in uploads, upload media, device. Which I've just chosen. As you see, comes down, and then all I do is click on this. As you see, I've clicked on it twice. If you do click it on it twice, just click on the one you don't want and then click on the bin and that's gone. So there you go. I've now got the logo. Let's put that right there. Love that. Commission machine. Okay, now I'm going to add a little bit more text. So I'm going to go slightly smaller. So I'm going to do the subheading here. And right, let me see where am I going to get. I basically want to, this is my headline, I'm getting it from there, and I just highlight here, fab, I'm going to, oh that a bit bigger than that, to click on that, okay, I'm going to change, I want it a bit bolder, it's better, lovely. Um, maybe a bit bigger. 
No, I don't like that. This one. Okay, then you can also, if you want, like the spacing here, so the line height, I'm going to, I want it to go up a bit. That looks better. Right, love that. That's better. Now I'm going to match the same color as the title. Click on that. And then I'm going to move it down. Okay, so you've got I've got logos, some head logos and headings. Um, accelerate now. Also, I'm gonna I want to put a little picture that will represent accelerate. So to get any pictures that um, you can either actually let's go back. You can on the Canva. You can actually go to photos. And you can type in here. Let's just say, let's see they've got they've got that's free. A lot of these are you have to pay for them. As you can see, the ones with the crown, these are, pro, are the pro. So this is what you have to pay for. Um, see so if there's any pictures that are free here. Oh, a lot of these. I mean, they're lovely pictures, but obviously you've got to pay for it or any of those. So another way you can do it is. Um, If I can spell it, accelerate PNG, click that. Okay, then all these pictures come up. Images, let's have a little look at some of these. View all, and I can choose one of these. Let's see which one I fancy. Which one do you think will go? I oh, can't say quite pastely. Okay, this is a quite good one. It's quite pastel or go with, I think we'll go with my colours. So basically, so I um I right click, save image as, and it's going to go back into my save folder. I'm just going to put here. Right. Not sure if I spelled that right. Okay, save that. Now, obviously, it's got, I don't want any of this background. So to remove that, if you go to this site here, remove.bg, this is a great little move. This is how you can get rid of backgrounds. Move background. Upload the file to where I've saved it. So there we go. Choose it. Download it. Okay, here it is in my download file. So I'm just going to put it over into my other one. Then back to Canva. To uploads, upload media, device. There we go. It's going in there. Click on that. There you go. Oh, I like it. Actually, the colours go beautifully, actually, with this. Then, obviously, you can make this as big or as small as you would like. Okay. Love that. See? And, it, and there we are. And that is basically how... You can add things. Um, I'm going to do it a little exclusive. I should have one already saved here. She says, I'm going to add in. Okay, maybe I'll do that a bit in a minute. Oh, here it is. Here we are. So I'm going to add a little exclusive button down here. I'm going to bring this down here. Plus, I want this behind. I want this to go behind the wording. So, if you right-click on here and put "send backward," there you go. And then it goes behind the wording. Also, I'm gonna tilt. I'm gonna like move it a little bit. So I want it like that. I'm gonna bring it up a bit so you can move it around a bit. Bring it up. Also, this is the transparency. If you click on here and take it down because it's like a little bit in your face, and then I can just make it a little bit. Fainter. I'm going to bring it up a little bit more. There you go. So anyway, I hope that's helped. Okay. So when you have got your page exactly as you want it, you then just download it. So make sure you've got your here. You've got your heading. You can go to file. You can save that. Download. Now. Down a PNG, you can download it as a JPEG, which is a smaller size. 
Okay, so I'm going to just download this as a PNG to download it. Once you've downloaded it, make sure you find it in your download file and I move it over into, I have a little commission machine, FB commission machine. I have everything in one folder so I can find it. And there it is. So that basically when I make up my bonus pages, I can just go here and I can find this bonus tutorial that I have made earlier. Lovely. I hope that's helpful. And um, if it is, please press like. If you want to comment, if I can help you in any way, please just put your comments below and I will do my best. Thank you.